please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Certainly. To utilize the Python ESCPA printer library with the Zebra ZP500 label printer, you'll have to make some adjustments. It's important to note that the Zebra ZP500 printer uses a different language, ZPL, Zebra Programming Language, rather than ESC slash POS, Epson standard code for printers. Therefore, Using Python ESCPAS printer directly with a ZPL based printer might not be straightforward. Instead, you might want to send raw ZPL commands directly to the printer. Here's a tutorial on how to get started with printing using Python and ZPL commands to communicate with the Zebra ZP500 printer. Firstly, make sure you have the necessary packages installed. You'll need the Python ESCPAS library to create a connection to the printer and Pyaseeb for USB communication. Install these using pip. You need to determine the USB connection to your Zebra ZP500 printer. You can use tools like Lsaseeb on Linux or System Information on Mac OS to find the USB device name of your Zebra ZP500 printer. For Windows, you can find this in the Device Manager. Now, let's write a Python script to send ZPL commands to the Zebra ZP500 printer using Python ESCPAS. Ensure you replace vendor underscore ID and product underscore ID with the appropriate values found for your Zebra ZP500 printer. The ZPL underscore command variable contains a simple ZPL command to print hello, Zebra, on a label. This script sends the ZPL command to the Zebra ZP500 printer through USB. Always test with caution and refer to the ZPL programming guide for the Zebra ZP500 to understand and customize the commands for your specific label printing needs. Remember, this example demonstrates the general concept of sending ZPL commands to a Zebra ZP500 printer using Python and might need adjustments based on your specific requirements and printer setup. ChatGPT To use the Python ESCPAS printer library with the Zebra ZP500 label printer, you'll need to configure the library with the appropriate settings for the Zebra printer. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do this. Step 1, install the necessary libraries. Make sure you have Python installed on your system. Then install the Python ESCPAS printer library using pip. Step 2, connect the Zebra ZP500 printer. Connect your Zebra ZP500 label printer to your computer via USB or a network connection, depending on the printer's capabilities. Step 3, Find the printer's device URI. Identify the device URI for your Zebra printer. You can usually find this information in the printer settings or configuration page. Note down the URI as you will need it in the code. Step 4. Write the Python script. Here's an example script that demonstrates how to use the Python ESCPAS printer library with the Zebra ZP500 label printer. Make sure to replace your underscore device underscore URI underscore here with the actual device URI of your Zebra printer. Step 5. Run the Python script. Save the script in a file with a.py extension, and run the script using the following command. The script will send the specified text to the Zebra ZP500 label printer and print the label. Make sure to verify the printer settings, including paper size, before printing to ensure the best results. ChatGPT